Welcome to the BSE in NX 2.0 training tutorial, the new fully integrated blank size engineering and nesting plugin for NX 8.5. Begin by accessing the file pull down menu and open the BSE in NX tutorial part file named BSE in NX case. The next step is to access the start pull down menu and turn on the NX modeling package. Users can then add the BSE and NX icons to the toolbar by right-clicking in the toolbar region and selecting BSE and NX from a list of available components. Next, click the Unfold button to begin the process. If a warning message is displayed, please continue for instructions on preparing the geometry. In this case, the part is a solid model, so we will need to use the mid-surface command to first generate a mid-surface. Begin by selecting the solid body. Ensure that the progressive option is toggled on, and then click Automatically Create Face Pairs. When the mid-surfacing process is complete, ensure the Hide Solid Body Upon Apply option is on, and click OK to complete the command. Once the part geometry is prepared, click the Unfold Part icon to begin the unfolding process. First, click the Material button and select the appropriate material from the integrated database. In this case, we will be using high strength, low alloy 350. Set the material thickness. And then click the Find Sheet to select what geometry to include in the unfold. In this case, click the Select All button to choose all of the part surfaces. When the process is complete, users can check the generated mesh by toggling on the Mesh Display checkbox. At this point, additional constraints can also be applied, such as fixed pilots. Select the type of constraints and then use the cursor to apply the points to control on your part. Click close to complete the command. After the desired constraints have been applied and any advanced settings have been configured, click the Run M-Step button to begin the unfold process. Once complete, the blank outline will be displayed below the part. After the unfold process is complete, users can automatically generate a comprehensive report by clicking the Report button. Select the Output Format and click Apply. This will briefly launch the post-processor and then a report will be displayed. Once the unfold command is completed, users can continue to the nesting module in order to calculate the optimum blank layout configuration. And in this example, we will be using the two up configuration with an edge width of four millimeters, an addendum of five millimeters, and a bridge span of 10 millimeters. Additional constraints can also be applied based on the coil requirements, and the advanced setting box can be activated in order to adjust the units. Click Apply to begin the nesting operation. When the process is complete, users will be presented with a list of potential nesting configurations with the optimum material utilization option presented first. Manual blank control is available by clicking the manual button, selecting the blank to manipulate, and then accessing the translation or rotation buttons. Dynamic blank control is also available by selecting the blank manipulation button, clicking over one of the control points, and moving your mouse cursor to manually adjust the blank positions. Once the desired configuration is achieved, Users can close the command, click OK to accept, or cancel to revert back to the default. A detailed nesting report can then be generated by clicking the Report button, entering any available variables, and finally clicking OK. This completes the BSE in NX 2.0 training tutorial. If you require more detailed instructions or information on advanced functions, then please reference the user manual available for download from our FTP site.